Well, it's a reminder we share at the start of every school year, but one Arkansas school district believes it is worth repeating. If you see a bus with its stop sign deployed, you got to stop. It is the law. Michael Aaron is live in Pulaski County and Michael, those school buses are already out this week. Yeah, Amanda, the school bus drivers here in the Pulaski County Special School District are out making dry runs. That means that they are driving their routes, making sure that everything is OK and that it will operate smoothly on the first day of school. They say that it is all about safety and they're hopeful that an updated Arkansas law will keep kids even safer this school year. Man, safety. It's always going to be the number one thing. Safety, safety, safety. Charles Anderson's bright yellow shirt is not worn by coincidence. And as you see, I can have on this bright yellow shirt. When you see the bright yellow school bus with the red flashing lights, we want them to stop. As the person who oversees transportation safety and training for the Pulaski County Special School District, Anderson not only wants people to stop for school buses, he wants to remind them it's the law. First of all, to the stop signs, STOP, stop. You know, instead of just yield or instead of just proceed and run through a stop sign, child, a child's life is, can be in danger. Here are the rules of the road when the red lights are flashing. If you're on a two lane road with no grassy median, both directions of traffic must stop. Same for highways that have a center turn lane and those without a median. One of the few times vehicles traveling in the opposite direction don't have to stop for the bright flashing lights when there's a median 20 feet or more in width. New this year, the law specifies you must stop at least 30 feet away from the bus. Failure to follow the law could come with the fine between $250 and $1,000, 90 days in jail, or both. Leave early if you need to get to school, if you need to get to work. Uh, leave, give yourself time, especially if you know there's bus stops on your route. Uh, because they're going to stop. Great advice there. And here are some numbers that help highlight why having this conversation and sharing this reminder is so important. The state that re the state reports that back on a single day in 2019, Arkansas bus drivers reported more than 800 instances of drivers illegally passing the school bus. Again, that's more than 800 in a single day, Amanda. Well, Michael, there's actually a statewide campaign now to prevent these bus related accidents, right? Yeah, it's been in place for the last few years and it is here in full force. Once again, it is the flashing red kids ahead campaign. So an easy reminder that if you see that stop sign deployed or those red flashing lights that you can uh, guess, you can imply that there are kids there. And it's just a great reminder because we've heard the terrible, tragic stories of kids being hit by buses here in Arkansas in the past and across the country. And uh, we can all do our part to help prevent that. So important. Thank you so much, Michael.